my friends welcome back to my 200 3d CAD problems in FreeCAD series today I want to work on exercise 21 in exercise 21 I want to break this work in three parts first I want to build circles and then I want to build the triangle and then I want to build second series of circles finally I will do some boolean operation to create this model so let's go ahead and then get started with it so step one is to create these three big circles of diameter 80 let me put some diameter value in them right now all right now I want to constrain them so the distance between these two would be 173.2 and these two centers will be symmetric by the axis and they will be 150 millimeter apart from the third center so that's our first sketch I'm going to say step one or step one circle okay I want to make an extrusion out of it for total 20 and I want to make that symmetric by the plane so that's our first step the secondly I want to build this straight bars the three of them so make a triangle to do that I'll be using this step one circle sketch so what I did is control C the one and then control B this one so what I did was select this one and hit control C on the on the keyboard or you could do copy and then control B place it right there so this one I want to rename that as step two triangle right and let me go ahead and make that visible and I want to edit that to do that I want to hide this and so we got that this is the one that we are editing and in that one I don't want the circles so let me make them construction geometry but I, I need to use their centers and that's why I'm keeping them so I want to do a triangle just like that and bring it up here and meet it back there so I'm trying to create the outer boundary alright so as you can see the the total distance is 20 the from the midpoint the distance is 10 so the distance between these two will be 10 and so will be this the distance between them is 10 and distance between these two will be 10 as well and distance between these two 10 and that that makes it constrained I want to do the same thing inside so let me take another line and maybe up here and here right so here the distance between this line will be 20 all right and the distance between these two 20 it makes it parallel this this is 20 and this is 20 that makes uh, fully constrained sketch so that's our step two because I made those outer triangle construction geometry construction geometry does not show up in the final drawing so I will I will shed more light on the construction geometry in a more complex sketch later on but for now just know that if anything is construction it's within, within the sketch but it doesn't show up on the final drawing I want to make this extrusion 10 and I want to make that symmetric right so that's our bar so we have 
So this is phase one and this is phase two. Step two. And step three will be these tiny holes that I'll have to dug out. So I'm gonna take this sketch and hit it say paste. And I'm going to rename that as step two circles. So those are the smaller circle. Okay, go ahead and hide these two. Pressing space hide hide things. And this diameter is will be changed to 50. Right? That was easy. So we reused the sketch three times in our advantage. Here is the inner circle and that will be 20 symmetric as well. All right, so we have three parts. Now this is the outer circle. I want to keep some part of it. And this inner circle, I want to take it totally out. So if I say this one and then take out the inner circle, we still have that some corner part of the triangle. So we will have to be careful about the sequence of this Boolean operation to produce this result. So what I want to do is I want to make this outer circle and the triangle one body. Okay, so that's one body now. From that body, I want to delete the inner circle. So that way, we took that corner out as well. So sequence in Boolean operations sometimes is really imp important, especially when it's in cut or intersection. Um, all right, so that's our object. Pretty simple. We wanted to show uh, use of Boolean operation in a little bit more detailed fashion. I hope you enjoyed it. I will show something exciting in exercise 23. I will talk about a little bit more about spreadsheets. So I hope I'll see you in that video. Thank you for watching. Bye.